So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a pix art editing. So if you want to see it, just keep on watching. But before we move on to the editing part, subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any videos that I will upload and might as well follow me on Instagram. So if you want to see how I recreate some of pix art arts, just keep on watching. So in this video, I will try to recreate some edits that other YouTube videos made. Hopefully, I will make these edits justice. So I will link the videos that I've recreate or tried to recreate in this video so I will link those videos down below so you can watch the original version of this editing stuff in this video I will hopefully achieve those edits and not mess up if you want to see me recreate those videos let's begin editing so hi guys welcome to my webcam so I will make sure that step by step so let's move on to the ECS photo to edit. So this one is, we will just outline the photo. So select the highlighter drawing pen. I'm just making an outline to match the colors of the clothing. For me, this is a very easy edit because I'm just following the lines of the clothing. <laughs> This one the second photo it's basically the same format but go to the so go to the normal pen and outline your entire body or the entire photo that you are editing the first edit and this one are the same because you're just following the lines of the photo we will make a cartoon version of ourselves in this second edit just follow along guys
So this one is optional. We're just putting some highlights on the photo like stars. So this is the last photo. So this one is kind of difficult in a way but go to the tools and use the cut off selection tool and we will remove the background as you can see it became black. So go to the drawing canvas part. We will make a background and select the color you want on your background and pull down the selection we just did and we're done. We have a background. Click the stickers and we will find a holographic thing that we can put on our face so it looks like we're melting on a holographic photo. So for me, I find hard looking for that specific holographic photo that the video just did. So I found this one, which is cool enough in this photo. So as you can see, we can change the color. If you want to really change the colors, go to the hue and we match the holographic thing to become a yellow. So go to the tools again and select the, the stretch icon. So when you use that, we will just adjust the size of the stretch and then we will drag down the holographic on our face and we will try to make it blend and looks like it is pouring down on our face so basically that's the final edit so that's it guys don't forget to give me a thumbs up comment down below if you have any questions and if you have any other suggestions or anything else just comment down below and might as well follow me on Instagram. So that's it guys. So see ya.